Go ahead, put it up. Okay, 49.99. excited? Yeah, me too. Oh, um, this has been declined. Oh, I have some cash. Can I open it when I get home? Yes, you can. You can open it when you get home. This is only $30. You're still $20 short. Well, that's all the money I have. You're at a store where a mother living paycheck to paycheck has promised her son a new toy for good behavior and for doing well in school. But the toy he picks out is too expensive. Times are rough on the family. They can't afford it. If you see this, what would you do? Sweetie, times are just really hard right now and I can't afford this. Today, we've taken over the aisles of tons of toys in Wyckoff, New Jersey. The first customer overhears the interaction between our actors, Angela and Aiden. I just don't have enough money right now, sweetie. I'm so sorry. Um, we can come back next week, OK? I know I promised, but we can come back next week. I just don't have the money right now, OK? You said I can get it today. I know, I know, I promise. She takes out her credit card and motions to our cashier. Do you want to yeah. pay for Sure. You know, you don't have to do that. I know. I, I, really... I don't have to do a lot of things. <laughs> That's what I want to do. Thank you very much. Sure, of course. You ready? Yeah. OK, let's go. Thank you. That was so nice of you. Why'd you do that? You know why? Because sometimes you just need to let up the money. Yeah. We continue to roll. Just things are really tight right I have now. Money in my piggy bank at home. I know, but there's not enough money there. I just need 15 more dollars, and next week I'll make sure and get it for you. Okay? We'll put it. Do you want We'll put it down. Do you want to take care of I'll it? Take care of it. Yes, thank you. Are you sure? Yes. No, I, that's Absolutely. so. One more. I'll take care. Of it. You make the card. Just take it. Thank you so much. Thank you. Okay. Come on, buddy. He doesn't get it. He doesn't understand why she can't. Say it. Hi, ma'am. Yeah. Oh, my God. I'm John Oh, Keenan. my God. <laughs> it's part of the show. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you for stepping in. Hmm? He deserves to have it. She promised him. And somebody has to help. Do you have kids? Yeah, two yeah. boys. How old are they? 12 and 14, but my younger one has autism. And he would never understand if that happened to me. What do you tell people who, uh, who might see something like this? themselves in real life. If you can help somebody, help them. And then maybe someday someone will help you because it comes around. It's just a toy, but still so many customers want to do what they can to help a mother and make a little boy happy. But that's still not enough, I'm sorry. So I they can get it, mommy? Fifteen dollars more. Yeah, it's fifteen dollars. I'll take care of the difference. Okay. Well, that's so nice, okay. Thank you. Um, thank you so much. Thanks. I really appreciate it. <laughs> thank you so much. You're welcome. Have a good day. Why don't you do that? That was so nice of you now, too. That was Because nice. everybody thank falls upon hard times. And it's tough as a mom, so it's okay. How cool is this, huh? Yeah. Sorry, you're, um, you're $15 short. 15 Yeah. Sweetie. Yeah. I got it. It's just a little tight. I got it. That's really sweet. Thank you so much. No problem. Thank you. Thank, thank you. You're welcome. This woman listens to Angela talking to Aiden. It's okay. It's all right. She watches and hears the interaction. Thank you very much. And the second our mother and son leave. Okay, that was good. Here I just spent forty dollars on a Rottweiler. Yeah. Why did she remain silent? Actually, when they were leaving, I thought maybe I should go after them, and then I didn't because I've spent a lot of money, money lately, and I thought well, that's, then I thought, well, that's kind of selfish. I felt, I felt embarrassed for myself, actually. We roll one last time, and how will this customer react to what she hears? So we can't get it, Mommy? Not today, sweetie. I'll, I'll try and save up some more money, okay? Just, money's really tight right now, and I just can't afford it, okay? I know it's only $15, but I just can't afford it right now, okay? I know, don't be upset. I'm sorry. I know you've been doing so good with school. Maybe we can. Thank you so much. She can't seem to even look at them. And like the previous customer, she decides to let them leave. And she says almost the exact same thing. 
That was heartbreaking. Okay, that was heartbreaking. But Melissa Ostello, also a mother, lingers and agonizes over what to do. And as we later discover, she's struggling with paying some of her own bills. And as much as, like, I wanted to turn to her and just be like, right, I'll buy it for you. You can't do that to her. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, I just feel like, I don't know, should I have been that woman that did that? I don't know. <laughs> I'm like... Yeah, it's tough. <sighs> My heart breaks, though. How much was it? And she was like $15 short. I'll do it. Is she yeah. there? Is she there? <laughs> yeah, would you see if they're still there? Yeah. I totally will do it for $15. I want to help in any way I can. I just... Wow. Thank you so much. You're so welcome. You're so welcome. Really, I can get it? Yes, absolutely. <laughs> You're welcome. Say thank you. <laughs> Aww. You look like such a sweet little boy. I have a little boy. How old are you? Eight. Oh, my little boy's seven. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. So let me get that for him. Okay, okay great. Yeah. Go get it. Go get the toy. Just the whole thing. Did you catch that? At first, she offered to pay the remaining $15. Thank you. You're welcome. You're welcome. But now she takes care of the entire amount, almost $50. It was really, really I generous. I know Thank how you things so much. are. I know how things are. Oh, my God. Hi. Hi. I'm John Quinones. Hi. With What Would You Do? Oh, my God. I've seen you guys so many times. <laughs> I'm, like, in tears because I, he was such a sweet little boy. <laughs> it was hard. It was hard because just to see his face, it was, I'm sorry. I'm just, I was just. You I just wanted to be happy. Well, you were really torn. With yeah, it. I was, but you know what? I, I have a seven-year-old, <laughs> and I wish that somebody would, would do that to me one day if I ever needed it. So we I'm might. going through a rough time right now, so... You needed those $15, too. I need those $15, too. How tough are times? Um, I have a little boy at home that is, I say, sick. I don't want to say sick. Um, he was diagnosed with a very rare genetic disease and we've struggled for medical bills and things like that. So I can remember being in stores with him and having to say no to him and broke my heart. And um, I just want, I just want, I just want everybody to be happy. And I want to be happy and that was making me happy. Hi guys, John Quinones here. Thanks so much for checking out our YouTube channel. There's so much more to see. So click on this red button down here, the one that says subscribe, and you won't miss another What Would You Do moment. Enjoy.